welcome Leah's it is the month of January we are going to be checking out to see what's coming up for January um, this is the year 2022 let's see what is coming out all new subscribers please subscribe um, please like and share these videos um, if you want to see the extended of those videos please use the join button um, in order to get to the extended of these videos so, um, I want to say thanks to the support of all the Leos that has been supporting me thank you financial discipline is coming up for you Leos in the first week spiritual career and it's fall in your house Leos a spiritual career fall in your house so Leos there's a awakening happy endings okay and this is happy endings to um, a situation with a Sagittarian okay now we see love um, in the house of money then we have karma completion so Leah's you have completed a karma and it is a karma to do with financial um, to do with finance finance money okay creativity and that is in your house of career so they're saying be creative okay a rebirth is going to be coming up in the third week a pride is uh, in the third week also um, that's in the house of uh, contracts physical um, activity is coming up also in the third week The fourth week we have uh, self love. Aventure. Changes. And Elin. A lot of you um, are even in the 12th house is very, very, very good. Okay. So that means a lot of you are even your carbers. Okay. So with that even in this 12th house, it's, it's really, really good. All right. Um, you have 55 and 66. Those are major issue. Okay, major issue. So you have to work on your karmas and you have to work on, uh, you know, like going out, having more fun, you know, meeting more people, getting to know people better, that sort of a thing. So you have two major issues. And the center and alignment of this month is karma karmatic ending and prides is going to be coming in okay so you have a judgment call some sort of a problem um problematic situation with your finance okay you have a judgment call then we have the energy of the world a cycle is over with a situation in the second week on the third week i see some sort of a contractual agreement but this has to do with um, relationship, love relationship, okay? It has to do with rebirth of a love affair. And the fourth week, I see a whole lot of secrecy. And the secrecy is about self-love because there is something. It's as if a lot of you could be seen, different people, and there's a whole lot of secrets. And they're saying, 
have self-love because you're like splitting up yourself all over the place okay so that's why the self-love is coming in mm. Mm. All right. So we're going to be breaking down the moon. So. Breaking down the moon. Week by week. We're dealing with karma. Karma completion. Karma completion. Okay, Leo, Sun, Moon, and Rising. Coming up for the Leo, Sun, Moon, and Rising. Leo, Sun, Moon, and Rising. Leo, Sun, Moon, and Rising. So you have water, you have hurt, you have water and water. Very emotional um, month. A cycle is like love and money. And this house. It's about the house of Venus, okay? Problematic situation between you, Leas, and a Taurus could be coming up. Or if there was problems between you and a Taurus, it's going to be over, okay? All right, so let's see. Judgment call. What's the judgment call on? Judgment call is on a group of friends, okay? Um... And if you see this energy is in your house, Leah's, and you're having problems with friendship, problems with friends, okay? There's um, problems with friends, okay? Judgment. You, Leah's, wanted a new story, too, but... An end is coming in. It's as if you, Leah's and friends, fell out. You wanted a new start, but um, uh, no, it's not. It's not gonna happen. And like you, Leah's wanted um, some sort of a start in another city or another place, another country. It's not going to happen. Not right now. Okay. A lot of you Leos are protecting yourself. A whole lot of protection. I see Leah men wanted a new start. Here you are. You're in the reverse. You keep on coming up in the reverse in this month. And Leah men wanted some sort of a new start with a career. It's not going to happen. Not, not in this month. Here is, and it came up together. I just shuffled and shuffled these cards. In the third week, huh? I see in the third week, a lot of you were hoping for some sort of a new contractual agreement. And I see you'll be getting news from a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpion man. Okay. There's a lot that is going on, Leo. It's like it's, it's a stillness of the silent. All right, the secrets that are coming out has to do with an Aquarian, Gemini, or Libra. It's coming up as a Libra. No good news. No good news, Leo. This is six of ones, you're ending a month, but the six of ones in the reverse. So judgment call is coming down, Leo. 
And it's as if Uleus was open that the Pisces Cancer Scorpion man would have brought you some news on by the way, Leos, you could be getting in some sort of a um, physical uh, thing with a Pisces Cancer Scorpion man. Okay. No good news for a Leo man. And I see a Pisces Cancer Scorpion. Some sort of an alteration, physical alteration. With a spicy skin, sir, scorpion man. That is going to be coming up. Okay, so in the first week, a judgment call is here on your friends. Leah's no new storage. I see you're having financial strain. You could be asking friends and family for help. And I see a happy ending is going to be coming in. Is this April? Um, some of you went back to work and then all of a sudden, um, you get to find out um, that, you know, the company is not moving forward. Okay. Eight, um, two, that is 15. The energy of the devil, spiritual career. But it's, 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 if someone is blocking your, if you're doing anything um, spiritual for work, it's as if someone is blocking it. And it has to do with your friends. And it's a Sagittarian. Um, if you were in a marriage or relationship with a Sagittarian man, I see a happy ending is coming in. And this person is happy that a situation is now being ended. I see um, you're going to be going back to apologize to someone, Leo. It's, it's, it's as if you're, 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 you're returning an apology to someone. I see family gatherings, family situation is going to be coming up for you, Leo's. Family gathering, friends and family. You're going to be overcoming um, a problematic situation with a Sagittarian. Okay. Definitely. I see a cyclic is going to be coming, um, um, coming around. Oh my God, you have twice the energy of the lovers. Oh, Leah, you are twice 66, twice 55. Oh my God. So love is in your, in, in the house of money. And there is some sort of a contractual agreement, but I see, um, as a situation where you have to be taking care of your parents or someone is sick and uh, you have to take care of this person. And you know, it, 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 love and money is uh, inheritance, okay? So some sort of an inheritance could be coming up. I see you, Leah's, wanted to reunite with a Virgo, um, but this Virgo is protecting themselves from you. This Virgo has actually moved on, okay? I see um, a Capricorn... Man, these, these are three men together. And I see um, some of you, Leo, could be falling in, a Cap falling in love with a Capricorn man. But some of you, Leo, could be finding out that your husband is in a same-sex relationship and is in love with another man. Okay? Yeah, there are three men surrounding this situation and um, this experience is uh, career and work. 
but it's as if this person um met this person through work and is um having an affair with them but it's another man okay it's another man okay a telling moment is here um for you Leos, there's a problematic situation with some sort of a contract or agreement. It's gonna be handed. So you Leos, a marriage with a Taurus, a marriage with a Gemini could be ending. Okay, and I see you have a lot of worries that the contract a contract is going to be ended. There's a lot of worries for you, Leos. Okay. Um, a Libran, they're now recognizing that a Libran had a whole lot of uh, um, documentation and information. Whoever this Libran is, man or woman. And, you know, um, this Libran was, was trying to get some sort of a... It's, there is something with you, Leos, and a Libran. And, and you and a Libran having the same data and information and... Is this Libran? Do you have a sister or brother who's a Libran? Because there's a lot of problematic situation with you, Leos, and Libran. Okay. Okay. Physical alteration. Let's see what's coming up for that. Okay. Physical alteration is uh, um, money. So here they're recognizing that a Pisces Cancer Scorpion person um physical alteration with money um and this is in the house of the aquarian and they're not going to be recognizing that you leos is connected to this man it could be your father it could be your husband but there is a situation where this man could have took a whole lot of money okay yeah, this man could have took a whole lot of money. And uh, I see now some sort of a resolution. A tower moment is here to all the secrecy. There was a lot of secrets that was being kept. And all the secrets that has been kept, a tower moment is here. Changes, seven. Um, a lot of you need to find self-love, okay? There could be affairs going on. Yeah. So they're now going to be recognized because I see data and information is going to be coming out. And they're going to be recognizing something about uh, a, um, Libran, a, a, a Libran, okay? No good news for your enemy, whoever your enemy is, um, whoever your enemy is, no good news for your enemy. Okay, so some sort of an alien is coming up. Um, 66 is alien. It is alien karmas. It's an alien of karmas. So there is an alien of karmas that is going on between you and people who you have brought, you were brought in with karma's wit, okay? So, what a month! Oh my god! Oof, so. Mm. Alright, let's break this down. So, we see an apology coming in, Leo, okay? Or you could be going to apologize to um, uh, Aries and helping this Aries out. Okay. In the house of money, there is uh, an older man. Um, and it's as if you were dependent on this older man to help you out financially. Maybe some of you are married to an older man, that sort of a thing. I see worries for this older man um, because this older man is... Um, is is um 
is in prison and is mine or worried because of his marriage. So it's as if um some of you maybe it's your father, some of you is your um an older person that you were seeing. And this person was helping you out financially. And I see that that's where this sort of a problem is because it's in the third house. Okay. A Gemini is, um, I don't know how you and a Gemini are connected. But, um, a Cancer who you are connected to is connected to a Gemini. And this Cancer is going to go to jail. And the Gemini is going to divorce this cancer because I see a tower moment for this cancer in the house of the cancer, a tower moment because the, the cancer had a lot of secrets. And there is a tower moment for the cancer. The cancer had a lot of secrets. Okay. Then we're looking at uh, um, your house, Leos, and there are problematic situations with family and friends. Okay. A whole lot of problematic situation with family and friends so there are things that is happening and problematic situation with family and friends um, in the month of January okay uh, as we look at the house of the Virgos your your uh, a, a karma a karmatic connection between you and the Virgo is now ended so if you're trying to reconnect with a Virgo, it's not going to be happening. Um, because it's as if this Virgo is protecting themselves from you. It's as if this Virgo recognized, so I need to finish this karmatic connection. Okay. So it's about a Sagittarius is behind all of this because here is a secrecy of a Sagittarian. Okay, and I think the Sagittarian could be secretly letting the Virgo know it's time to end. Um, or the Sagittarian is protecting the Virgo um, because the Sagittarian recognized that this has become a disaster. And a Sagittarian is protecting, and this could be um, a family member or so that is protecting this Virgo from you because you and this Virgo, the karma... Um, between you and this Virgo is going to end. So if it's a relationship where you live with this person or you were working for this person, Sagittarian is protecting this Virgo from you, Leos. Okay. So the Eight of Wands is another um, situation where um, information is coming in. Okay. Or you were wishing and hoping to hear from a family member or a loved one. Um, it's taking longer, yes, um, because this person is uh, and want to regain status of themselves. Okay, so it is a situation where a lot of you could be looking for a job, a lot of you, and it's taking long, okay? Um, and this is like pride because you're looking for a job because you want to be independent and it's taking longer. You're getting, you're getting more, uh, you know. So yeah, that that's that sort of a, a situation that is going on. But whatever it is, I see the energy of the sun, and the energy of the sun has to do with you overcoming whatever the problematic situation is. Okay, um, there is a whole lot of problems concerning contracts in that sort of a situation. Okay. Then we see the energy of Alventure, and this energy of Alventure, it is basically some sort of a, um, changes is coming up because uh, they're now going to be recognizing what a Libran have done, a Libran and a Scorpion have done, or what a Libran have done to a Scorpion. And this is going to be creating a whole lot of changes. Okay, so the Alventure is that if you was the mother of a Libran, and a Libran was in a relationship with a Scorpion, they're now going to be recognizing what this Libran have done to the Scorpion and how this Libran got in a Scorpion world, okay? Um, um, there is going to be some sort of a successful ending that is going to be coming in. See, the ending is not coming up 
it's endings and it is as if yeah you have to move you have to relocate some sort of a problems but you are going to be having a successful ending where um if you were at a company an international company they're going to be paying you out so you are going to be leaving you have money so you can have time to find another job okay um then we see this energy this is over the romance okay and a lot of you are going to be finding out that your husband was uh, having an affair with a man okay or if you were in a relationship or, or you leo men or great uh, they're going to find out that you had an affair with a man okay so this is going to be coming out and i see your wife uh, um, is going to be finding out that you Leo men had an affair with a man. Okay. Your wife is definitely going to find out. And how your wife is going to find out is that a Pisces cancer scorpion person is going to be telling your wife, um, that you had an affair with a man and this man gave you a lot of money. So it is a situation where your husband has been having an affair with other men. And uh, um, and now this this um this man is um being very brutal now because uh, um this rich man and this is coming up as uh, seven and six is thirteen. Mm hmm. Yep. And thirteen. It's an end. You have 15 there. 13 is an end. And you have 12 there. So, Leah's who are having, like, um, working for a... Uh, 13 is for a cancer man. This cancer man is very brutal because this cancer man is going to be telling your wife that you have been having an affair or you have been having an affair with them or you have been having an affair. Um, yeah, that you have a same sex and affair with a same sex person and you got money from this person. And this is really because six and seven is 13, 13, one and three is four is a cancer. So I see some physical alteration between some of you Leo man and a cancer man. And this is going to be very serious. Okay. And it's about this man just brutally uh, told your wife that you have been having an affair with him and he has been financially supporting you or helping you out financially whatever it's just brutal <laughs> so i see finally you're going to be healing some sort of a karmatic situation with your enemy and that's why you have enemies okay but finally this healing of this karma is now going to be ill whatever that was happening and transpiring I see no good news for your enemies and I see a, a major tower moment is going to be coming down for this person. A major tower moment. And I see a lot of secrecy in family is coming up. They're now finding out a lot of secrecy in the, the, the family of a cancer. And if you Leos are connected to a cancer, um, you got to be aware because the secrecy of this family is now coming out in a huge dramatic moment changes for the family okay especially if you were in some sort of a relationship okay with this person all right let's see what is coming out honesty is going to be the best policy okay so i see honesty with friends and family is going to be the best policy right now whatever is happening in transpiring that's the only thing that is going to get you leah's out is honesty is the best policy and it is it fall in your house leah's okay honesty all right and 
abundance is here also and this is very good it fall in the six hours so you will have enough um, money and financial status in um, this um, this month okay discipline fall in the house of contractual agreement discipline um, that is coming up a Sagittarian you're going to be having problems with a Sagittarian okay discipline having problems with a Sagittarian and debt debt and the debt that is coming up debt with some sort of a business some sort of a um, corporation some yeah debt because twice the energy of the tower you have tw tower moments um, I see end to it's like um, um, extended family okay so that's going to be coming up and to a job and to a position you're going to be looking for another job you're going to be um, looking to get um, more a financial stable so you have honesty abundance discipline and debt okay and the tower moment is in the house of your family um, and it surrounds secrecy of your family and this is all going to be coming to an end and to your um, to your enemies okay so that is going to come up I do love you guys namaste